Hello, hello boys and girls, this is Undersil of course, and oh yes, I am so happy to be able to bring you guys uh, the very first time I actually played Gun... Oh, Gun Master, I think Battlefield 3 calls it, or DICE calls it. Uh, I call it Gun Game, because uh, it originated in Counter-Strike, and uh, I played a shitload of it in Counter-Strike. Uh, I wanna, uh, I wanna apologize straight away for this video. This is the very first game I played. I won it, and I wanted to give you guys a video as quickly as possible to show you how it is. Uh, I did not know that the server would be a bit laggy, so you're gonna see some people that you think I should have killed and stuff like that. Uh, that yeah, you, you will simply see that I'm aiming at them and they're not dying. <laughs> simply. <laughs> Uh, it was a very laggy server, I noticed that about halfway in, uh, but I actually managed to win the round anyway, so I thought it, it was worth uploading just because of that, since it feels pretty goddamn good to play the jump in late, I was about 35 seconds late, and if you don't know how gun game works, gun game works this way, uh, both in Counter-Strike and in Battlefield 3. Uh, you simply start out with uh, a, a pre pretty pretty weak gun, a pretty weak pistol, uh, then you move up to a bit more powerful pistol, then a bit more powerful pistol, then to a weak submachine gun, then a little bit, then a bit better submachine gun, then a, then a weak assault rifle, then a more powerful assault rifle, or maybe it's shotguns, yeah, shotguns prefer <laughs> before assault rifles, uh, and so on and so on. You, you're gonna see the entire thing, and Last of all, you're gonna get a. You have to get a knife kill to win. Simply, uh, this was. Uh, I'm, I'm thinking this server lagged because it had a bit too many players. And look at this. Uh, this is the very first game I play, and I wanted to look at the HD destructible environments. And I gotta say, it actually looks pretty goddamn cool after you battle it out in in one of these places. I mean, I think this is Seba Towers, if I'm not completely incorrect. Uh, or, yeah, I might be incorrect actually, uh, never mind, it will probably say exactly which map it is on the on the video description, I mean, I can't learn all the names of every gun and every map in the entire game, like, the first try, so I mean, yeah, <laughs> it's not easy. And basically there you can see your progress, and you can, you see that I'm on the Magnum, but you see that, like, a lot of people are before me right here, and three other people are two two steps before me, and or two other people are two, three other people are two steps before me, now four, and one is four steps. You can see how it's kind of moving in the little, little, I don't know, a little, the little bar, basically. The little bar in the, in the bottom of the screen, simply. And you can see uh, it's highlighted the bar I'm in, and I'm in the magnum one, and I'm having a big problem. As you might, you might know, I'm a, I'm pretty goddamn good with the magnum. Most headshots stick for me and stuff like that. I love the magnum just because if you aim good, it works. And that's a good example of the lag. On my screen, it shows that he's looking at the other direction. Uh, but all of a sudden I'm dead, so I'm like, what? Okay. And like, people are like, lagging forward and stuff like that. It's not my computer, as usual I record in 60 FPS, uh, medium slash low settings, and on uh, on uh, 720p. So it should be as crystal smooth as possible, so all the lag you see is actually the server, sadly. And some people who are on the server, there's like one or two people who are like three, four, five hundred ping too, and there's not really much you can do about that. And I covered ping before, so if anyone wonders what ping is, you should go back and watch a few more of my videos, simply. And you can see there, the guy who is in the lead has the MTAR21 right now, and I'm just on the... Oh god, what the hell do you call this gun? The PP-19, or PP-90, PP-19 I think, yeah, PP-19. And as you can see, every time you rank up to, this, uh, to the next rank, you get a fresh gun, fully reloaded, so if you're lucky, you can go on some sick killing sprees, where you simply never have to reload, and th this, was what it, this was what made it so fun in, in um, Counter-Strike, uh, to begin with. Uh, simply because you could you could just get super lucky and get like some sick ass killing sprees and just rank up super quickly. Uh, I like I like all the weapons they they put in all the loadouts except one. They put in the one of the automatic shotguns with frag rounds, and when you get to that, 
you're like, oh god damn it, it sucks. <laughs> you're, yeah, here we go. It's the the MK3A1 uh, with the with the fragrance, as I said. And I'm like, no oh, derp. I noticed that uh, <laughs> that it explodes and that it's a frag. And I'm like, oh, okay. Fuck, okay, this is not gonna be easy. So the first thing I thought about like was okay I'm just gonna fire completely randomly, but as the fucking noob I am sometimes I managed to shoot at desks I'm down to 40% health and I'm like ah oh, god damn it derp 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 <laughs> And as you can see you can destroy walls and shoot through them uh, through the holes and stuff like that And I gotta say I'm really impressed actually about the detail I put in in the maps. I mean the maps looks they look just fucking stunning. They, they, they look literally stunning. I am so happy about this. I feel like I've gotten what I paid for. Uh, the only sad thing is that this map lagged. I made sure to... I played about uh, one more one more gun game on... Or a half a more gun game on this server. Then I stopped and switched server and played... Uh, Conquest Domination on another server and that didn't lag in oh my lord that was a pure joy I was running the Spaz 12 with the slug uh, you guys might have noticed that if you looked at the tapes video the other day with the Spaz uh, me and him uh, we're just playing having a little bit of fun uh, and uh, he, he said Anders you, you gotta fucking try out the Spaz with the slug it's it's amazing <laughs> No, he didn't say it like that. Uh, and I did, and it is fucking amazing. It is so nice. I mean, oh god. Uh, so you, you can look forward uh, as soon as this goes up, about um, two hours maybe, it will take me to render and edit and upload the, the other video because it's very short. So I might be able to get it up in like one and a half hour or something like that if I'm lucky. It's just like five minutes long. Uh, but just to give you like an idea on how the game modes look like and how the maps look like. Uh, when you're not playing on PlayStation and stuff like that. Uh, simply because, I don't know about you guys, but I get angry every time I look at a video. I, I was, I basically searched up these maps on, on YouTube and I thought like, okay, I'm gonna find some, some PlayStation or Xbox and w watch. And I just got angry because people can't fucking aim with the sticks. I see how they're like moving slowly and they, they aren't aiming and oh god, it's like... I don't know, it's like watching my dad trying to play computer games. That's how it is as a PC player to watch someone who play who play Xbox or PlayStation 3 play a game that really should be on PC. I mean, don't get me wrong, it's totally cool to play on the console. I mean, it has tons of benefits like price and stuff like that, but I mean, it just... It just pains me to see, and I know how hard it is to aim with sticks. I'm not saying you guys suck, you, you guys are playing on console. I, I just say that I, I just can't bear watch it. I mean, when you're used to a mouse and then you, you see people who are actually maybe used to using controllers and still they suck uh, at aiming, and I mean, you, you really can't aim with a, with a controller. You really can't. You can't aim with a stick. You need a mouse to be able to kick ass Viking style. <laughs> and as you see, now we're getting to the end here. I got the M, uh, M116 or M114 or what the hell it's called. The new sniper rifle. And then we're gonna finish it off with the last sniper rifle. The one you actually unlock. I haven't played with this one yet. I just actually unlocked it when I, when I finished the third uh, game on Conquest Domination. I played. Um, went really quickly, like 15 minutes, because they were like 5 minutes each. And I gotta say, those like first few shots with the the GNG, GNG, I don't know, uh, 90 sniper rifle, it kind of, it felt pretty solid, and I think it might be a sniper rifle I would like. I'm gonna do a weapons review of that really, really quickly too. Maybe I will be able to get that video out today. Also, I'm gonna try, but I can't promise anything, but... Yeah, <laughs> so I'm on to the very last weapon here. I got the knife and I'm like, okay, surprise butt sex is coming. Daddy, daddy wants some asshole. <laughs> That's exactly what I'm thinking right here. And so uh, I get, I get super lucky. Look at this noob. He's just lying here 
But for some reason, I don't get the the full takedown. I just slash him. Uh, I'm guessing because he's like moving around. But I get the kill, and I won the very first gun game or <laughs> gun master game I've ever played. Fuck, it's gun game. I'm gonna call it gun game. Or maybe I have to actually name it Gun Monster so you guys actually know what the fuck I'm talking about. Anyway, <laughs> I gotta say I fucking enjoyed uh, Gun Monster and uh, you guys are gonna look forward to more videos. So if you haven't subscribed yet, make sure to do that as usual. Thank you guys for watching. Have a wonderful day. Bye bye.